was really exciting. Well, before we have fun, Dizzy, we have to go to Farmer Pickle's place. Some of his trees were blown over by the wind last night. Oh, no. No, <laughs> it's all right, Dizzy. He wants us to cut them up into firewood. Bob, Mr. Bentley just called. He wants us to clear the snow from all the country lanes. I can use my snowplow, Wendy. Good. That's just what I told Mr. Bentley. Can I come with you, Bob? Can I, can I, please? <laughs> okay, Dizzy. You can carry my chainsaw. Oh, brilliant. Okay, everybody. Let's go. Can we fix it? Yes, we can. Uh, yeah, I think so. Hello, Farmer Pickles. Good morning, Bob. <laughs> Hello, Scruffy. <laughs> Travis, isn't the snow brilliant? Oh, yes, Dizzy. It's very pretty. Here are the trees that were blown over, Bob. But they won't be wasted. They'll make plenty of logs for my fire. Great. We'll have them cut up in no time. Chainsaw, please, Dizzy. Oh, here it is, Bob. Thanks, Dizzy. Now, look after Scruffy. Chopping up trees can be dangerous work. Okay, Bob. Come on, Scruffy. <laughs> no, Scruffy. Come back. You <laughs> <laughs> oh, caught you, Scruffy. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Dizzy. Look what I can do. <gasps> oh, don't, Spot. You'll get all wet. No, I won't. <laughs> the pond's frozen, see? So I can do this. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Look at me. <laughs> I'm Spot the Skater. <laughs> oh, no! The ice is breaking! Oh, oh. Stay with Spot, Scruffy. I'll get help. <laughs> oh, hurry, Dizzy! Hurry! Oh, my scoop! What was that? I hit something, Wendy. It's buried under the snow. <sighs> That's dangerous. I'd better dig it out before someone else runs into it. We can load the logs now, Lofty. Uh, okay, Bob. <gasps> Bob, Bob! Spot's in trouble. He was skating on the pond, but he fell over, and now the ice is breaking. Oh, no. We'd better hurry before he falls in. Show the way, Dizzy. <laughs> Careful, Spot. Don't move. <laughs> I'm I'm all right now, Farmer Pickles. Really? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Don't move, Spot. Can you reach him, Lofty? Uh, I I think so, Bob. Try again, Lofty. You can do it. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh. I did, didn't I? Good job, Lofty. Spud, you should never go out on a frozen pond. The ice might not hold your weight. Uh, yes, Bob. Uh, no, Bob. No, oh, sorry, Bob. <coughs> Scruffy's right. Ponds are for ducks, Spud, not scarecrows. <coughs> Hello, ducks. Oh, dear. You can't swim on the frozen pond, can you? And they can't find anything to eat, either. Well, we've got to check on my other fields. We'll pick up the logs later, Bob. Okay, Farmer Pickles. Oh, poor ducks. You must be really hungry. Yes, and they're not the only ones without food. Look. Oh, no. Can we do something, Bob? You know, Dizzy, I think we can. How strange. It seems to be some kind of tunnel. Wendy, huh? look. Oh, 
So that's what it is. It's the porcupine crossing Bob built. Uh, Wendy. Oh, no. Porcupines. They must have been hibernating in there. They look really sleepy. They shouldn't have woken up until spring. Winter's too cold for them. Hello there, Wendy. Oh, where'd you find those porcupines? They should still be hibernating. If I hadn't bumped into their crossing, they'd still be asleep. Should we put them back and cover it up again? Oh, no. You mustn't do that, Scoop. We'll have to let them go back to sleep when they're ready. But it's too cold to leave them out in the open. There's only one thing to do. We'll have to take them back to the yard. Good idea, Wendy. Hi, Bob. Have you finished cutting the logs? Oh, hello, Wendy. We got kind of distracted. The pond's frozen over and the ducks don't have anything to eat, so... Dizzy's going to take this bird seed out to them. I'm Dizzy the Duck Feeder! Yippee! <laughs> Don't worry, bird. I've got something special planned for you. Did you and Scoop clear all the roads? Uh, no. You see, we got distracted, too. They were hibernating, and we woke them up by mistake. They need somewhere warm to stay. Hmm, I've got an idea. Great. I'll finish the logging. Scoop can clear the roads by himself, can't you, Scoop? No prob, Wendy. Bye, Bob. See you later. Now, let's find somewhere warm for you to stay while I get to work. Bob. And Farmer Pickles has enough logs to last him the rest of the winter. And I fed the ducks, Bob. They were really happy. I'll bet they were, Dizzy. Do you like my bird table? Now, Bird and his friends can come by for something to eat any time they want. <laughs> it works! Yeah! Rockin' table, Bob! Uh, what's this, Bob? It's a porcupine house, Lofty. All it needs is some straw and something for them to eat. Sorry, Pilchard, but the porcupines are really hungry after their long sleep. There you are, your new home. Oh, <laughs> I think they like their new home, Bob. Hooray! 